Now, I didn't spend a lot of money on this, but you know what? I'm not here for you to judge me, just watch the goddamn video. It's an everyday thing, it's an everyday thing, it's an everyday thing when you let your nuts hang. Good morning, Oklahomies. Man, it's your boy PJ. Hey, today I'm having a cheapo depot breakfast, so I ain't got no food, so I gotta get some. So, to make this breakfast, this. Turn that on. On my 1965 Frigidaire. That still works perfectly. And the hot dogs. Right. My kitchen's a mess too. But we're gonna get to that. Because I got a lot of stuff to do today. Includes work. Say hello, cowboy. Cowboy. Wanna go outside? He ain't fuck with y'all. He just looked up. I don't got nothing. That goddamn fridge looking in. Hey. That's why we have a hot dogs for breakfast. Gotta have a poke cup. Some of this on that. Check the flavor, but you know you got one of two kinds in there. Oh, mountain. Ooh, I think we running on old. Yeah. Guess no coffee or cream today. What better than a cheap breakfast and coffee with no cream? Because apparently I roll like that. Everything is empty around this bitch. Jesus Christ. How's that sandwich look? All right, everyday people. About to have this uh, black jailhouse coffee and my uh, po' man's meal. So I'll holler at y'all in a little bit. Peace. What it do, everyday people, man? It's your boy, PJ. And this is my wildlife show. This show is brought to you by Bush Ice. Anyway, today on PJ's wildlife show, uh, we gonna go fishing. So here is my pole that I found. And I think I threaded it wrong, but they're mine. Um, so uh, we, gonna, we got some lures and shit that we gonna put on here. So don't mind my drinking because I'm gonna do that a lot. This is the wildlife show. I'm gonna be outside with a bunch of flies. What I got here. We went 
to our wildlife refuge store, Walmart, and uh, picked up a few things. We got us a trusty plain no tackle box. I got some uh, snap on floats. I got some uh, eagle claw snails bait holders. Sunflower seeds. Uh, some bass casting sinkers. And what every redneck fisherman needs. This is a cat hook. So we're gonna, before we get to fishing, we're gonna get, install this right here on a OSU hat. So, like so. Now we can get busy. Oh, hold on, one more thing. These are some new shits. Heavy duty wire leaders. So, let's see how this works. Since I'm wildlife, I use whatever I can find in the outdoors. And this is one of these hacksaws, so I'm gonna use this to cut this line. Uh, we don't need that no more. I have no instructions. So what I do know is what I wanna do first is I wanna add this floater on here because I wanna have enough line for it to sink in the hole. So I'm gonna add this floater at the top. And the way you do that is, all right, so you grab this bottom hook, bam, like so. You grab that top. Uh, you gotta push the bottom and the top. Just like so. Now that ain't going nowhere, right? Now, what I wanna do is, I wanna add this on there. This is the uh, weights. So I wanna keep my weights on there. God damn flies. I just hope the fly don't end up in my bird. Distance from the bobber. There you go. That's about 
so that way it can sink a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Like you want your you want your deal to sink. And then, okay. Now we're gonna add on these heavy duty wire leaders. You know what? As I get to doing this shit, I need to put this shit up in my trusty tackle box. Now I just spend a lot of money on this, but you know what? I'm not here for you to judge me, just watch the goddamn video. Okay? Now, I have no idea what this is for, but it looks important. Oh, I know what this is for. These are, so I can slot stuff off in here. You know what I'm saying? Cause I got extra spots. That makes, I can have extra spots. All right, just in case, no need to hurt. All right, so that's that in there. All right, so now we got the wire leaders and I ripped that off and I didn't even know that I could close it back up so I'm gonna be more careful with this one. Alright it came with six. Now I didn't spend more than ten dollars on all this stuff. Um like I said I know I'm not here for y'all to judge me. I just want to show y'all how to get this shit done. Okay. If you want to be frugal like me, be frugal like me. And guess what? <laughs> when I catch a big ass fish, you're going to be paid for it still. So, they'll fit in my tackle box.
All right, so that's that. Now, I got this on there, right? So now I need to add on the uh, eagle claw. Now, now this is easy to do because all I have to do stay in place because I got my hook hooked in here. That's always a safety measure. I don't know if that's what it's actually for, but that's how we're doing it since I was young. So there you go. All right, next thing we're doing, we're going fishing. So everyday people, man, thank y'all for tuning in to uh, uh, the Southside Wildlife. And uh, our next episode will be at the lake. All right, everyday people, I'll holler at you. Peace.